Hello you crab banging cuttlefish, Jim Sterling here and this is Night Cry. This is that game that was on Kickstarter that was a kind of spiritual successor-ish game to Clock Tower. And I like Clock Tower quite a bit, so I was all about this. Uh, although admittedly, the gameplay footage they showed did not look great. Uh, in fact, Retzebray did a, um, a video on it, making fun of it. And people were very wroth with them because... They were like, well, this is a spiritual successor to, to Clock Tower, so it's going to be good. Uh, but, like I say, footage didn't look great. And it's actually come out to a very mixed reception. People seem really 50-50 on this, whether it's good or shite. So, let's find out for ourselves. Nightcry, I've been looking forward to this for a while. So, I'm a little sad that the reviews, the user reviews at least so far, are, are so split down the middle. But, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. So here we are, August 18th, 2016, so it's set in the far future. It's just loading something up. It was, was that the intro cutscene, just to let us know it's a boat? It is set on a, I believe, a cruise ship. Alright, here we go. Okay. <laughs> wow, her hair is... Her hair and her boobs do not exist in the same reality. What? <laughs> yeah, I will. You can't have... No. You can't have voice acting emanating from the NPC when they're that far from the camera. Oh, well. Anyway, here we are. So it's point and clicky. We don't get a stylized mouse or anything. It's just... It's just a mouse cursor. Well, that's a shame. Well, click on this dude anyway. You, know, you think maybe like a pair of scissors or something for the mouse cursor. It sure is hot in here. Could you take my jacket? <laughs> he received it like it was some holy relic. God, he is humorless. Why is everything so slow and deliberate? Like, I get the feeling like she might be drunk, like, the way she came out of that party. But he's the same. It's like they're both acting the way drunk people do when they want to act super, super sober. It's just so slow and deliberate. Anyway. We've had our jacket taken. There we go. What is that walking? <laughs> Oh, she looks like she's holding in the biggest of dumps. How unfortunate. Right. Out we get. I'm not done here yet. Oh, shit. She's here to avenge her father. I guess back out here. Well, maybe she wasn't drunk. Maybe it was just, oh, I'm so hot in my jacket. This door leads to the party floor. The sound of music and laughter can be faintly heard. All right, can, can, can I not get out? No, all right then. Okay, so I guess we'll see what's down here then. Come on. No, nope, that is the, oh, got her running. Well, this is the only dude to interact with. Let's do it again. Talk to him some more. Oh, a different angle. Ooh. Oh, sorry. Harry is a friend of mine. Oh, a friend of yours. Yeah, then I definitely know where he is. He's tall, short hair. I didn't see him anywhere at the party. Well, she's given him a distinctive description. He came and left down the hall a moment ago. Maybe it was him. Okay, thanks. It's through that door, right? Yes, ma'am. Okay, apparently the... Lips of characters only move when the game remembers that people have lips. So yeah, production value's definitely not the best. Let, let's put that out there now. I mean, I would put this... This looks like a what would be a, a an acceptable early access game from this level of quality so far. It is, it is finished, though. It is like on Steam, not in early access. Oh, fuck. 
<laughs> okay. To be fair, we all have an earthworm living in our hair. It is the cause of most neck rashes in America. But people love it. It's a fashion statement, you know. Dude, he's touched your jacket with those pussy, rashy hands. Need a key card, don't we? That's why it's closed off. Get it running. Oh, let's see what this is. Brochures for this cruiser are on display. Okay. Let's see if we can find some horror, gang. Oh, there might be some horror. These two might be horror. Let's see. <laughs> I can't get over that run. That's fantastic. That's capital. There's the bar. In fact, let's go in here. It's always nice to know where the bar is on any cruise vessel. Let's chat to the bartender. Get ourselves... Fucked. Oh no, no voice acting here at all. I've had enough for one night. Maybe you're right, let me know if you'd like some mineral water. Maybe you're right, Judgy! No, I think, I think I'll have this dude's water. Oh, oh god, no, it's an eye. What do you call this again? I used this in school ages ago. Alright, didn't give us much time there. Let's chat to this fella. Hello, young lady, are you back from the cocktail party? It's a vampire! I guess you didn't find your knight in shining armour, huh? Oh, what a creepy man. Yeah, something like that. Are you on vacation with your wife? Uh-oh. Is he a dirty boy? Travelling... Dirty boy! Why is he wearing... He's wearing gloves. I am Vigo Boradsov. Borisov, the owner of this ship. Yeah, you're also probably a murderer. That's a human eye in that thing. Wow, you own this ship? Yes, it always brings me joy to see passengers such as yourself having a great time on my ship. I guess I'm enjoying myself. Haha, ha, don't be afraid to speak out if there's anything we can do to increase your comfort. Oh, God, what a sinister bastard. Yeah, can you, um... Well, it would increase my comfort if you, like, upped your commitment to the masquerade a bit more. Oh, for God's sake, why is he barking now? There ain't nothing there, dog. Dog's an asshole. Everybody knows it. The menu on the table is various drinks and snacks. Oh, I didn't see that last bit. It don't matter. None of this matters. Come on. Along we go. I'll see what's up the stairs. Oh. It's roped off. My one weakness. Okay. Don't know if this is the right way or a right way or where we should go. But we are running down anyway. Nothing but footsteps to guide us. Well, that's going to be closed off, isn't it? Unless it's our room. Yeah, it's not our room. Okay, that's fine. We'll find something. We'll find something exciting to get into. Don't you worry about it, chum. Card key reader. It seems the elevator can't be used without a card. Oh, good. All right, we begin the silent trek back down the corridor. Da, 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 da. Don't worry about that. There we go, come on. You can do it. I believe in you. Don't have to keep double clicking. Just hold it down and she'll just keep running in a straight line. There we go. You can't change direction though, so you just click and hold and she might abruptly stop like she did there. you got to constantly re-steer her like some sort of horrible car person. Alright. So at least we know we're currently stuck on uh, this floor. Oh no, maybe not because we've got an elevator there. Uh, oh, here you are. No wonder I didn't see you two at the party. Jessica got tired of the party, so I came along with her. I don't get why the best-looking guy here is, like, obsessed with Rooney. What a joke. Mickey Rooney? Oh, you mean the conductor, Jerome. Yeah, I think that was his name. I'm not into slim guys, so... Oh, hello? I'm right here. That's it. Just, just stagger past those two. 
Wasn't there something I was supposed to do on this? Oh, for fuck's sake, I don't fucking know. I don't know what your goddamn deal is. All right, well, we'll go over to those. There were those two people conversing by the old bar, so. Come on. Oh, for God's sake. I hold it down and t now she's just stopping. All the Right, here they are. Well, that dude's pretty tall. The pair are conversing rapidly in whispers. It's hard to make out what they're saying. It could be a foreign language. Oh, okay. We're in the midst of our first puzzle. Uh, this, the cruise ship strangler here, needs a lighter to boil his eye. His prosthetic eye, I should point out. He claims it's prosthetic. Uh, and she said there might be a lighter behind the bar. So, well, no, they're just talking about him opening his bar. Oh, wait, what's this? Hot towels and matches on a well-polished counter. You found an item. Matches! The nightmare begins! <laughs> I just got an achievement. That you found matches. The nightmare begins! Hell yeah. Scary matches. Well, let's solve this puzzle, shall we? If only there was something to light a fire with. You can select items you find from the inventory in the upper right corner. That's him telling us! Fantastic! Okay, matches. Boil the eye. That should do it. Oh, thank you, young lady. You saved me. You saved me. All right, well, now what? Vigo's artificial eye is dancing in the beaker. Looks like it seems as if it's trying to make eye contact with you. Oh. All right, what you got to say for yourself now? I feel like I've been all around this ship. Thanks, young lady. You were a great help. By the way, I've heard that there are certain items you can even use on yourself. Dude, you are laying on the, the smut a bit thick. Don't have a clue what kind of items you could use on yourself, though. Mm-hmm. Dirty old bastard. Right, I just had to talk to these people again, I think. They told me that Harry was on the lower floor, so... I guess that's where we're gonna go. Oh, fuck. It's a monster. It's not really, I was just being ageist. Right, lower floor. What floor are we on? Oh, I guess the game has decided for me what we're doing. What? I can't hear what she's saying. I've got my headphones lower than... Okay, well I guess we won't question any of that. Cool. Well, our protagonist took that quite well. Here we are, lower floor, friends. Let's see where we're going now. Looks like it's about the same setup, doesn't it, for every uh, floor, or at least for this floor. Oh, wait, no, that's veering off that way. I can't be sure of anything. Uh -oh. Now it sounds like the nightmare begins. See, I'd have said that this was the, the nightmare, not so much getting uh, some matches for someone. <laughs> All right. Okay. I noticed their feet in that cutscene were kind of frozen. <laughs> it's kind of weird. I mean, that's, that's what I'll say of this game so far. It's somewhat strange. <laughs> Everything about it just seems ever so slightly off. Let's have a look at our uh, vending machine for soft drinks. Many of the brands are unfamiliar. I don't know. I think we will... Cool cola is something of an American tradition. Let's have a look at this deadbeat. Ah, there's that Harry. I see you left the party too. Ha. Huh? Oh, God, did you go dress like that? Yeah, did you see a little girl come by this way? Just me until you came, babe. Oh. <laughs> uh, how's the party? You said you found a guy you like. I thought he was alright. He's not my type. In the end, I had to let him go. Haha, ha, sorry for your loss. Oh my god, he's putting his hand through her! Anyway, I'm going to talk to these people multiple times because apparently that's the way you get things done. Uh, still talking about uh, dating things, romance things. 
Come on, I was cheering you on from the sidelines. I didn't expect plain Jane to hand your ass to you. Go to hell. She could have chosen a better night to stay. Is that it? Are we done? Oh, no. Getting a cutscene now. It's like Dark Souls. You've got to exhaust your dialogue. This game is exactly like Dark Souls. And no, I will not get tired of comparing every game I play to Dark Souls. So you're just going to have to live with it. Come on, this this loading screen's quite taking quite a bit. It's like Bloodborne. Don't get yourself worked up now. Come on, I'll buy you a drink. <laughs> what? You think a soda will get you on my good side? Hey, you're thirsty, right? Here we go. Oh no, haunted cola can. What is it now? Well, uh, something is grabbing my hand. What? I said something inside here is grabbing my hand. Oh, Harry, the Gregory Peck Act is a bit outdated, don't you think? I'm serious! <laughs> Brilliant! <laughs> oh, the legs are twitching! Oh, that's what you get for wearing fucking shoes without socks, Harry. Okay. But again, in this game, it's getting the lighters that begin the nightmare. Right. Operating. Stamina. The game keeps track of the player's stamina. When the player's stamina runs out, they'll be unable to move. Fucking stamina meters. Running for a long time or resisting the attack of the scissor walker will reduce the player's stamina and the screen will flash red. Stamina will recover while walking or standing still. Just like real life. Mouse wheel. Click while running to dash. Okay. Left click. Hold your breath while hiding. Uh, recover from falling over. Select icon. Activate click point. This is a lot to take in. Center camera on the scissor walker. Right. Use an escape mode. Okay. So. Mouse wheel to dash. Left click to hold their breath while hiding. Resume. That's uh, her. <laughs> she runs like some sort of goblin. Oh, scissor walkers after us. No, don't. Of course, it fucking gets confused when we center the camera. Oh god, he's coming. Oh god. That's it. Get in here. Find ourselves a hidey hole. In there, that'll do. Go on. Get in there now. In there now, hip hip. Right. So we're going to have to hold our breath at some point. Here they come. I don't know when I need to do it now. Is this just a cutscene or a gameplay thing? I mean, I'm, I'm holding the left mouse button now anyway, just to... Just to be sure and safe. Go on, fuck off. Okay. So it's a little bit of a QTE situation. No. Oh, okay. We've just got to hold it here. Come on, we're alright. We're fine. Maybe. No. No. Fucked it. Oh, God. Get it. Fuck off. Oh. That just sucks. I'm running away. I'm running away now. Oh god, it's coming. Okay, now we've got to stand still. Nope. She's fallen over. She's fallen and she can't get up. Fucking hilarious. Getting another flashing. Oh, for God's sake. Here we go. Come on, get up! Just get off the floor. No response. Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright, this. We need this. Smash it. Smash it up. <laughs> Fantastic! Oh, it's running away! Yeah, fuck off! 
All right, rock, paper, scissors. Oh no, there's a dead thing in there. I don't know if that means the whole escape sequence is over or if we've just bought ourselves time, but let's examine. His smartphone is poking out his pocket. Maybe he was trying to call for help. Well, let's steal that. <laughs> Slimy, she complains while helping herself to a free fucking galaxy. You found item, smartphone, battery dead. All right. Take it, we can't use this. Control panel is dimmed. Okay. All right, well, we survived our first sequence. Okay, yeah, but the, uh, the dash button isn't happening now, so I'm assuming that we're okay. Let's go uh, look at the dead... Oh, there isn't a dead body. It's gone. I guess the scissor walker went back up into the Coke machine. <laughs> Why was it living in a coke machine? <laughs> oh, this just struck me as frightfully amusing. There are small scratches on the surface of the table. Oh, no. Judging by the state of the table, the scratches must have been here for a while. All right. Let's see what the story of this table is. Come on, go on. Get up in there. An ordinary wooden table. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Scissor Walker's gonna come out of the table. No? Oh, okay. I thought it was like a cutscene or something, but no, it was just the camera being weird. Fair enough. Fair dues, a mate. No, get through there! Right. I guess we can have a look in that room that was open, can't we? <laughs> God, she... I mean, I, I would have imagined that these events would have sobered her up, but look at her, she's still a doddering town drunk. She must have put him away at that party. I mean, she hasn't even noticed that her hair still keeps falling through her norks, so... There you go. I don't know if there's anything interesting going on in here. The only things in the drawer are amenities for guests. Fair, fair enough. What's in there? The suitcase is locked and will not budge. Oh, well, that is a shame. What's this here? Charger for phone. That's it. Take your time. There's a phone charger on the table. All right, smartphone, charger. Of course, if I could charge that phone. Talking like she's Sherlock fucking Holmes. Wow, that was quick. Holy shit, I wish I had a fucking phone like that. The name John Thompson is displayed on the startup screen. He found our item, smartphone, click this, okay. I'm gonna. We could call all of these. We could call Doctor Withheld. Angie Brown. The call isn't going through. All right, I'll try this person. Call isn't going through. Okay, try this person. All right, fine. It would have been nice. It would have been nice if we could have gotten something. SNS, John Thompson's post. Snap post. Look at that. It's got its own little thing here. Oh. Can we just, like, make our own fucking call? No. What was that name, John Thompson? I guess that was just the name of the... the actual bloke whose phone it was. Alright. How do I get out? Right, there we go. Oh, well, we got a phone anyway. So that's... that's events. So, try calling the rest of the ship. Seems the call is not going through. Well, we'll just go to sleep then, won't we? Sheets are wrinkled as though someone was recently sleeping here. Yeah, the scissor man was. Alright, I think we're done here. Cutscene! Went down this corridor and a cutscene happened. Oh, shit! Sorry, I didn't mean to frighten you. Are you alright? 
You look very pale. He's got the exact same face as the clerk at the reception. Right? What? what? Okay. I don't know what this is doing. <laughs> the death scenes are magnificent! Oh, God. They're almost as funny as the ones in Final Destination. All right, then. Let's have a look at the body. Maybe he's got some cool stuff on him. Oh, where the hell are we? All right. Whatever. Ooh, it is a convenience store. I don't feel like reading a two-week-old magazine. Yeah, you want something more current when you're being chased on a haunted cruise ship. Mystery is our newest achievement. Ooh, ice cream. Eat your troubles away. Oh, fuck. It's the same dude every time. Oh. <laughs> Why is it constantly living in fucking food containers? Oh, this is just fantastic. Come on, move, you fucking idiot. Oh, no, that's no good. Oh, we've fallen over again. I don't need to put anywhere to hide. I need to, uh... Let's recover our stamina. Oh, no. Ain't got time for that. I need to find something else we can hit or smack or something it with. Yeah, this way, whatever. Right, come on. I guess we're hiding in here. Okay, we'll try this. I didn't quite get the Heidi thing last time. I wasn't quite up for what it wanted from me if I was to hold and follow or keep clicking and following, but we'll try again. As Scissor Bloke tries to get us. That hair going through, that's... Uh-oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell was that? What was that? Night Cry, everyone. <laughs> Welcome to Night Cry. <laughs> oh, okay, that was Night Cry. Um, you can get it now. It's it's not great, and there is a kind of there's entertainment value in it. But yeah, I, I might play more of it and get a review up when I've gotten the Quantum Break review up and the Dark Souls one out of the way and all that, but... Wow. Night Cry. There we are. <laughs>